What's up guys, this is Crypto James talking to you today uh, about Acropolis. Now, Acropolis is trending hard um, on CoinMarketCap. The reason for that is it's been on an absolute tear over the last 24 hours or so. It's gone up about 25% over the past week. It's up about 50%. Uh, it has just been rocketing up. Um, so we're going to discuss in this video what Acropolis is, what this can hit in terms of uh, the next bull cycle. Can it make a new all-time high? I personally believe so, um, because this is one of the best sort of DeFi opportunities in the crypto space. Um, and we'll just take a quick look at how well it's doing. 28.2% up so far today. Absolutely staggering. Um, and a quick reminder, like over the, in fact, the past seven days, up 52%. Over the past month, up 307%. So it is on an absolute tear. Now, before I get into any of this, a quick word from our sponsors. Hey guys, and a word from our sponsors. So Cryptonomy.finance, these are early backers of uh, early stage crypto projects. Now, these guys have got in on some unbelievable projects. So they work with BitGo as a digital asset insured custodian, uh, and they work with Fireblocks as a, a digital asset custody provider but they have got uh and already worked with huge 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 projects within the crypto space like as early early backers uh, these are some of the projects that they have worked with now obviously some of them are doing 10x 2x but we've got some big boys here as well sweat economy did a 12.88x from when they from when people were able to get in to the high hit step app did 149x Victoria uh, Virtual Reality did 208x. GameFi did a 352x. The Race did 164. Opulus did 151. Um, so you can actually get in as an early backer of a lot of these projects if you have an account with Cryptonomy uh, Finance. And I'll actually show you how this works as well because they have seriously good uh, interest rates as well. Now, uh, as you can see, first of all. This is the interest account. So you can actually just exchange cryptos on here easily and there's no fees whatsoever. So say I wanted to exchange, I don't know, a thousand bucks of USDT for Bitcoin. Yes, I'll get 0.38 uh, Bitcoin, but I will pay no fees whatsoever. All I have to do is click exchange and then the request is sent. Job done. And now I've got my, now I've got my 0.385 Bitcoin. Um, now, I could actually just throw that into anything I wanted. So if I wanted to uh, put it into a Bitcoin fix, uh, sorry, Bitcoin flexible interest account, I could do that by just clicking deposit, uh, max out, and you'll see that I can earn 24.72% APY. But the fixed interest rate is 52.18% more. So it depends on how long I want to deposit and how long I'm happy without my Bitcoin. Uh, so say I deposited the max amount of Bitcoin. Now, if I have it for one month, I'll get 1% interest. If I wanted it for six months, 18.5%. Nine months, 40.5%. If I did it for a whole year, that would be 76.9% uh, interest across a year, which is obviously incredibly good. Um, and all you have to do is go through the process, continue. I've read the terms and conditions. Always read the terms and conditions, guys, and create and my request is sent, it will be pending status until it's approved. Um, but that's it, job done, and I'm earning that 76% because I'm happy going for a year without my Bitcoin. Um, this is the beauty of uh, Cryptonomy, and the wallet situation is as easy as it gets. You literally just go through the process with the wallet, same as you do anything else. If I wanted to withdraw, it's insanely fast as well. Um, and again, no issues whatsoever with this with uh, cryptonomy.finance and if you want to get in on the launch pools you can do the launch pool section is quality so you can see past events and how they performed so if i order it by uh, all-time high roi we'll be able to see uh, what some of these hit although it's not seeming to work right now maybe we'll click all-time high ah there we go pod fast uh, oh no, so these are ordered by the actual all-time high price. So as you can see, anyway, past events, huge uh, cryptos, and I've gone through a bunch of these before anyway. Um, so Gamium, as an example, is one that did a 41x. 
Uh, and there's always ones upcoming and you can participate as easily as ever. Um, just run through, have a look at the projects yourself, decide which ones you want to get in on. And again, it gives you the opportunity to get in early doors on projects that could be could absolutely explode in price. If this interests you, getting in on the ones that could 100x, 300x or whatever, um, there are a ton of links in the description. There's the Telegram links for the group. So you can go check out, talk to the teams, talk to the people that are using it. Um, and there's also a referral link for your account. Uh, if all of this, like I say, interests you, go to the links in the description to check this out. Um, this is not one you want to miss out on because, like I say, the APYs are outstanding. But more than that, those launch pools, you get in on the right one, you're going to make a mint. Uh, right, back to the video, guys. So, uh, let's take a look at Acropolis. So, uh, all-time high for Acropolis was... 8.8 .8, uh, cents so pretty good right um, it's about a fifth of the way there um, and as you can see it's broken through key resistance um, a couple of weeks ago or about three three weeks ago now and that's just resulted in the tear that it's been on so if you're unfamiliar with what Acropolis is Acropolis is a company that operates uh, an ethereum based DeFi protocol so it seeks to provide autonomous financial ecosystem for saving and growing wealth, uh, including through borrowing and lending. Uh, to do so, it offers a series of products, including Acropolis OS, which is a framework for developing for-profit DAOs. Um, and Sparta is a platform for uncollateralized lending, and Delphi is a yield farming aggregator. Uh, and the founders of Acropolis are uh, Anna Andri. Anna Andriano Andrianova uh, with Kate Kur Kurbanova joining later as a co-founder. Um, so it was co-founded by uh, Anna and was and she became an, when she was managing director of Apiro Capital, which is a data and tech-driven investment firm. Uh, in addition to founding private equity advisory firm Sirin Capital, uh, she has also had investment experience. From serving as a fund manager for the Lehman Brothers and an emerging markets hedge fund analyst for emergent asset management. Uh, they both have quite a history. Kerbinov, Kerbinova as well was head of analytics at uh, Syndicate. A Syndicate was a very popular crypto uh, project back in 2018. Um, and Acropolis, as I said, you can earn solid DeFi yield. It's built with alchemy. OZ and the graph. It's got integrations from Yearn, MCDX, and Liquity as well. And when you launch the app, you can see how the things work. So they have their vaults um, when the data loads. So this is the beta of Acropolis uh, version 1.1.1.1.45. Uh, it is provided as is, and they don't make any warranties, including. Acropolis is error free or secure because it's beta testing. So, as you can see, APY here for, uh, for this vault is currently 769%, but 0% is filled at the moment. So, it's always worth noting when you're looking at the percentages, you do have to understand how the percentages uh, work because if you're the only person that's necessarily providing it into the vault, you're not necessarily going to. Uh, be safe and secure um, and again you can just run through all everything on the vault very very simple and very very easy to use they also have a yield calculator which I really like as well uh, so I'll show you guys this when it loads one thing I will say Acropolis is a bit slow even if you've got high quality internet there's a lot of data that they're trawling through and, and uh, providing so it is a bit stagnant it is a bit slow so uh say you wanted to put a thousand dollars into any of these you can see what your yield would be across a year period and maybe you only wanted to do a month so you can see what a thousand bucks will get you across a month um and from there you can really start identifying which which of these are the best ones for you at this moment in time? You know, if you're looking to get a large amount of money in a very short space of time, 
then you know maybe you want to go from one of the higher risk uh, earn, earning mechanisms. But obviously, you've got to balance your risk profile. Uh, you can also compare all the pools as well. Uh, when this works again, like I say, it's a little slow, it's a little stagnant, but that's going to be the case with the sheer volume of data that they've got. So you could compare acro staking versus any pool. So let's go curve and tether. I think that's tether. Uh, oh no, it might be. No, it might be ETH, right? ETH. Uh, but 33.4%. So you can see which one you would want to get. Um, Staking is very, very simple. You can stake the Acropolis token. You get a solid 11.85% APR. And that's APR, remember? So once you claim it and you restake it, that APR goes up. Um, so again, say you wanted to go with a thousand bucks, you're going to get uh, 2.27 additional Acropolis per week. You can add that in. And obviously, it slowly goes up. It's not outstanding, it's not amazing. Um, but it's pretty good AP, APR. You can't, you know, it's pretty good across a year uh, for Acropolis. Now, Liquity <coughs> is the other um, provider within Acropolis's sort of network, and you can see you can you you can borrow uh, LUSD by leaving Ethereum as collateral. So loans are paid out in LUSD, which is a USD peg stablecoin. Uh, and need to maintain a minimum collateral ratio of 110%. So if you were going to supply, if you wanted to borrow, you have to make sure your collateral is correct. If you screw up your collateral, you will get your collateral liquidated, and then you'll be in a worse position, much worse position than you wanted to be. So it's always worth noting that. Uh, they also have the stability pool, so you can deposit LUSD to earn yield from uh, the liquidity rewards and liquidation gains so anytime someone gets liquidated you benefit which is not a great feeling i suppose is you're benefiting from someone's losses but you know it is a way of earning uh, and you can also stake the liquidity token and earn yields from uh, the issuance fees which are in lusd and the redemption fees which are in ethereum so you've got two different mechanisms for earning there as well uh, also, if you're interested in participating in, in the Acropolis governance, obviously you have to be an Acropolis holder, but then you can uh, vote on the whatever proposal has been put forward. Again, very, very simple, very, very easy to use. Uh, statistics wise, as of right now, they have 1,550 active uh, members that are consistently using Acropolis. Uh, the total value locked in Acropolis, because obviously you've got the yearn, you've got liqu liquidity embedded in. So it's about $886 million. Uh, 283 million Acro are vested, uh, have been all-time vested rewards. Um, and you can see the date till the next snapshot. So this is the balance of unlocked tokens updated once per two weeks with a snapshot. So you can see how the vesting period works. So all ACRO rewards are subject to vesting. So the vesting process is very straightforward. It's just worth reading through because you will want to know how this works. Um, because obviously you do not want to be confused about where your profits are if your rewards are stuck in vesting. Um, ACRO rewards are, sometimes, are subject to 12-month uh, vesting. Uh, there are also 32 stable coins available for deposit. So there's a hell of a lot within the Acropolis um, protocol that you can just use and enjoy. Uh, I'm personally a big fan of lending. I think it's a very good way of accruing uh, additional crypto. Uh, I do recommend if you are going to use uh, a lending protocol, you have to keep on top of your collateral. If your collateral gets out of whack, you are absolutely going to get liquidated and that's going to suck for you. So be so careful on that. Um, but Acropolis, uh, as of right now, 86.95% of the tokens are out. So, um, you know, still another 650 million tokens or so to be released, which doesn't actually skew the amount of tokens particularly. Um, now, 
One thing that I do expect that we're going to see more of over the course of um, of the next bull cycle is that we're going to see DeFi protocols have a really strong time. Obviously, we had uh, over the past couple of years, we've had interesting sort of, well, scenarios like FTX, you know, when FTX went under, that hurt a lot of people. So I think there's going to be a lot of people that were on FTX that got lost a lot that are going to end up using DeFi protocols far, far more. I think as a result, coins like Acropolis are going to benefit from that immensely. Now, there's no actual news about Acropolis, so it's not, this isn't a news driven sort of day. It's just that it broke, it's broke through key resistance multiple times over the last month, really. And as a result, we've just seen that sort of consistent rise in Acropolis. Uh, and if we look across the year, you know, still up 400 plus percent. Now, for me, I look at Acropolis and I go, this could be a 20 cents coin. This would honestly be looking at around eight, that would look at around $860 million market cap, which is not outlandish. It's not insane. And I do think in the next bull cycle, we're going to be seeing a lot of DeFi coins that have huge uh, market caps because I think there's going to be a little bit of a fear from people that were previously burnt by like FTX. I think they're going to get in on an Acropolis. Uh, so yeah, I think, I think these kind of coins could do something. Now 20X, sorry, 20 cents is only about an 11X or so. So it's not huge. Um, but in the meantime, you're earning because you could earn, you know, nearly 12% interest. So you add that on, so all of a sudden, you know, it's a little more, you're not just making 11x because you've been staking potentially. Um, but yeah, I think I think Acropolis could do something. I wouldn't be surprised to see it hit the billion mark. Uh, like I say, I think we're gonna see a lot of DeFi hit the billion mark in the next bull cycle. Um, but what do you guys think? Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And guys, like I say, check out cryptonomy.finance in uh, the description. The APYs on them are obviously insane and those launch pools look highly profitable. Uh, thing, if you want to take the work out of your crypto investing, if you want to make things easier on yourself, head over to copymycrypto.com. That is the website I run where I share with all the members everything I'm doing. So anytime I buy a crypto, I let my members know what coin I'm buying, why I'm buying it, what kind of gains I think it can have what percentage of my money I'm putting in. And they don't have to think, they can literally copy along. There is no work. Uh, as an example, did a video today where I was talking about the fact that, guys, September's coming. September is the worst month historically in all markets. It's a very well-known thing called the September effect. If you didn't know about that, now you do. Have a look at it. Um, so don't expect huge gains for Bitcoin in the next, or any crypto in the next uh, sort of month something to be aware of and that's the added benefits and the things you get when you join copy my crypto so if you've not gone to the website go to copymycrypto.com now have a look through the website um see what the members have earned since being on the site see what i've said in the past everything on there is public record uh so you can verify it all by going on the old videos on this channel and make an informed decision if it's something that you'd like to try uh, and that's it from me guys hope you're having a lovely day take it easy bye bye